All right, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to Cut the Rush Channel. Today we got uh, another feeding video. Here goes your boy right here that y'all love, Mr. Handsome. Hey, Mr. Handsome. Hey, Mr. Handsome. That's Mr. Cot. Miss Bird over there. And uh, you hungry? You want some food? That's the nub. Yeah, that nub squeaking over there. What about you? You hungry? You want some food too? I know you want some food. You always can. You what about you? You hungry? You wanna eat? Want some food? Okay. Alright, so listen, I love these dogs so much, right? So I went to the store and uh I actually seen this and we never had chicken backs before. And so I was like, hey, this is something else I can give the dogs, some variety they can switch up. It's still chicken, but um, I just thought it was cool. It's inexpensive, 159, so not too bad for you know what is this a pound, a uh, pound and a half. So it's not that bad. I mean, it's pretty pretty cheap, pretty on par with like chicken necks and stuff. I never seen this. I don't know if these are like little baby back carcasses or, or what it is. But I'm gonna add this into their meal today. So this is something new they're gonna try. Um, and like I told y'all before. All right, sorry about that, y'all. So, and as I said before, we're gonna be adding some Oregon meat back into the diet. And today, because like I said, also too, he was having a little itchy paw syndrome there. I think it's because of his gut health. Um, look at this, we got some blueberries, bunch of fiber. And people ask me all the time, like, what is something that I recommend that's not meat? This is pretty much the only thing that I really recommend to give to your dogs that's not meat because this is just extremely extremely good in gut health gut health and it really simulates that um that fur that they don't get from eating raw meat but this is like basically like a fur substitute that they usually would eat the fur the hairs and all the stuff from the dead game they would have this is the like the best alternative super super good for gut health Pretty much the only thing I recommend besides meat is just substitute for some blueberries every now and then. And again, that's keeping it simple. So that's what we're gonna be feeding them today. We're gonna have some chicken eggs, some regular chicken, some livers. We're gonna have some blueberries and an egg. If I have some eggs in there, we're gonna be feeding that. So they're getting a whole meal. And then they're gonna get two meals today. They've been on one a day feeding. I think Kai's getting a little bit thinner than I want him to get and he's starting back to exercise again uh so that's good he was went on in like a spurt without exercising so now he's starting to exercise again so we're gonna go from there and then we're gonna be adding all of these into the meal and let's see how it looks i'm gonna just feed them straight on the mat i've been doing that without the bowl no particular reason to just I, I switch it up from time to time so i'm gonna be giving them some food just straight on the mat and then we'll see how to eat it i'll be back in a sec now he's kind of interested here usually they don't do this but i don't know so what is this is this like a half it's like a literally just the back of the chicken carcass interesting so this is literally a chicken carcass back and you can get a lot of bone from this a lot of fats from this and some organ meats in there look at that that's actually pretty cool so I probably would recommend these. Let's see how they eat them. So yeah, you get some fats. Again, this is another one. You get some fats, you get some some organs in there, a little bit of organ. Um, and you get a lot of hefty, that, that spine, that spinal bone, those wing bones, that's what you get. This is very good. So this is a good, this is gonna be a good all around feeder. So you only get four to a pack which is not bad, but you, but for what you're getting, because you're only getting, like you're getting a pretty much healthy all around feeder. This is, this is something I would recommend. It's my first time seeing it. It's my first time picking it up. I probably won't be able to see it again because I don't go to that particular store. Um, but yeah, that looks pretty great. So let's see, we got some chicken feet here. We're just gonna add one. It's a lot of bone in this meal. And then um, I only need one of those. Let's see. Uh, September. All right, one egg. We're just gonna drop it on this mat. 
crack it. Two eggs. Bet. These are bad, so we're gonna throw them away. Unfortunately, we got two, three left. It is what it is. Uh, and then, we're gonna give him a chicken too. So that chicken is from yesterday. The bird didn't finish eating all our food. So I'm just gonna give bird that plate. Give him this, and then we're gonna add some, some, uh, Organ meat, ooh. All right, so it got messy. But I uh, got some blueberries here. I washed my hands. Make sure we don't cross-contaminate. And um, got to rinse these off. I'll put a few down here for Mr. Cut. He's probably gonna eat them all. Bird's probably gonna eat none of them. <laughs> but uh, we're gonna put us some here. So, got our food here. We got a chicken back, liver, some chicken paw, blueberries, and an egg with the shell. I don't know if they're gonna eat the shell off, but uh, let's push it across the floor. Watch out, get out the weight. Get out the weight. Watch out. That's a good son's meal and a good bird. Push this across. Uh, do I think bird gonna finish all this food? Probably not. But uh, she get finicky sometimes. But uh, all right, y'all. You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? Go eat. Go ahead, Barry, go eat your food. All right, so, go on, got him eating. Let me know what you think about that chicken bag, son. Chicken bag. Look at that. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. That look good, son. Weird. Eat your food, weird. Is he getting the blueberries now? There you go. Yep, yep, getting them blueberries. Chicken paw. Oh, they're gonna have a dump. They're gonna have to poop so bad. It's not even gonna be funny. It's gonna clean them out. And this, this meal is gonna clean them out. Bird over there eating hers. She eating a chicken bat? No, she what she a chicken paw. Okay, licking that egg up. Oh yeah. Get it son. Get it, son. Get that food, boy. Oh, hey! Chicken back right now. I see. Ugh. Hey, girl. Go eat your food. Go eat your food. Let the people see you eat the chicken back. Go eat your food. I don't need a. I don't want to give you no rub. All right, go eat your food. Go eat your food. Hey, girl. All right, let me leave her alone so she can eat. Uh, she's not going to eat. 
All right, y'all. That's pretty much it. She'll eat eventually. But, uh, she probably gonna wait for a boy. <laughs> Y'all notice I'm touching this paw. It's pretty rude. chicken back now. Get some food, man. Yeah. See how she eat it. It is weird because it's like uh Super slow eater, bro. <laughs> and this is actually a pretty good piece of like meat to feed them. Chicken bag, that's, it's like cartilage and a little bit of the spine on there still. Some organs on there. Fat. It's pretty good. Oh. Alright, so. Storage was full got that situated but uh now she gonna probably chew this up all over the floor bird please keep it on the mat baby she's not gonna eat the blueberries and she's gonna eat around it she probably ain't gonna touch that chicken yeah so it might be the thing where she not gonna touch the chicken right now is that good enough for you All right, y'all, so, oh, she's going for it, she's going for it. Okay. Yep, she ain't done yet, she's just slow. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop it right here, y'all, and uh, that'll be it for today. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section below. Would you feed your dog chicken backs? I would. I think it's a, a great thing. What you think? You like them? Did you like your meal? I think he's satisfied. All right, y'all. See y'all in the next one.